Parasaurolophus is a hadrosaurid, sometimes called a duck-billed dinosaur, from the late Cretaceous period. It is a herd animal that feeds on the park's rich vegetation. The most stunning feature of the Parasaurolophus is the crest on its head. Scientists were unsure of its function until today. Some believed it was a snorkel for when the animal was in the water. Others felt that it was used in combat. We now know that it serves for display and for communication, allowing the animals to remain in contact over distance by amplifying their haunting, beautiful cries. Triceratops is a large horned and frilled herbivore that lived in the late Cretaceous period in North America. It filled a similar ecological niche to today's buffalo, roaming the grasslands in massive herds. Although an herbivore, it is one of the park's most dangerous animals, reaching nearly 30 feet in length and weighing up to 12 tons. Its size alone makes for a formidable creature. Sporting a fiery temper and horns of over three feet in length, this is an animal deserving serious respect. Often referred to simply as Compi, Compsognathus is a chicken-sized dinosaur from the late Jurassic period. It was first discovered in Germany before the only other specimen to be found was unearthed in France. Compies typically hunt small lizards and insects, but like other opportunistic theropods, will scavenge larger animal carcasses when available. Dilophosaurus is a dinosaur from the early Jurassic period. It is a recent addition to the park and is our most surprising specimen to date. Still juvenile, our dilos measure in at six feet in length, with an adult expectancy of nearly 20 feet. Though they hunt in packs, they rely on a pack leader to incapacitate prey by expelling venom from glands in its mouth. Dilophosaurs can spit their venom up to 20 feet with deadly accuracy, aiming for their prey's eyes, causing blindness and disorientation. Herrerasaurus was one of the first theropods and lived during the mid-Triassic period, a time when dinosaurs were not yet the dominant land animals on Earth. Sharing many of the same physical features of later theropods, such as Allosaurus, this hunter, which can reach up to 20 feet in length, will swallow down huge chunks of prey whole. In fact, it can digest bone, something other carnivores usually leave behind. A fast mover with beautiful markings, Herrerasaurus is a wonderful addition to the creatures of Jurassic Park. Velociraptor lived during the early Cretaceous period. At an average of 11 feet in length, this incredibly intelligent and fleet of foot pack hunter is credited with initiating the dinosaur renaissance of the 1960s where the image of dinosaurs as slow, clumsy reptilian giants was superseded by an image of warm-blooded, fast-moving animals. In addition to problem-solving intelligence, one of Velociraptor's defining features is an oversized sickle-shaped talon on each foot. These talons are used during hunting and combat to inflict deep and fatal wounds. Tyrannosaurus rex is perhaps the best known dinosaur in the world, and for good reason. Standing over 13 feet tall at the hips, measuring over 40 feet from its snout to the tip of its tail, and weighing around 7 tons, T. rex was one of the largest carnivores ever to walk the earth. Its original home was North America during the late Cretaceous period, where it would stalk Triceratops, among other prey. Tyrannosaurus has excellent binocular vision and hence good depth perception, an adaptation essential to a predator. Despite this, observations have shown that T. rex's vision is primarily attuned to motion 
supplemented by a remarkable sense of smell. Our living specimens have proven once and for all that T-Rex was no slouch, reaching speeds in excess of 30 miles per hour. <laughs>